Hi, my name is Mignetti Von Patrick Dorsey, encouraging you to pick up a copy of Speak Truth to Power, the story of Charles Patrick, a civil rights pioneer. He drafted me. And that was the best thing ever happened to me when they drafted me. When I was discharged from the Navy, I came home and I wanted to leave Birmingham, but I didn't leave Birmingham. There were people in the South, in Birmingham, who did not necessarily, they weren't in front of the cameras marching with hundreds and hundreds, but they were behind the scenes doing very courageous acts that a uh, few people know about. I encountered these individuals because of the research I did, but there were many people just like Charles Patrick that contributed to what we now call the Civil Rights Movement. It all started December 11, 1954, when I went to get my son a scout suit. And I pulled up in front of a car that was gonna pull out, waiting for him to come out where I could back in. And when the car came out, another lady pulled her car in the spot, and I was going to back up. I said, lady, I was waiting for the spot. I don't care. I'm getting this spot. My husband is a police officer. And I said, well, if your husband is a police officer, he don't own the streets of Birmingham. But otherwise, you can keep it. And I pulled off. That was easy, except when I got to the part where he was physically abused, the first part in the book where I, I described the, the beating. Two officers held me while the big one hit me, put me in the floor, and kicked me under my chin, that scar you see right there, and busted. Most scariest thing in my life. I never had been in jail, never did nothing, nobody to go to jail in all my life. Where I worked, an American cast iron and pipe company they just told me to tell the truth and take depth if it would be because things were going to change from that. And that's what I was going to do and that's what I did do. I can't forget nothing. They done there killed me and kicked me all in my stomach and my sides and my ribs and things. You want me to forget that? I'll not do it. I'd rather die. I think you've uh, helped make the world a better place. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I feel good. Thank you. Thanks very much. God bless you. <laughs> you too. God bless you.